It is pretty easy to use MediaSite to record a lecture. Here's a quick little demonstration on how to use one of the Podium desktop computers in a classroom to do so. First, open up your favorite internet browser and navigate over to mediasite.osu.edu. Log in with your university name.number and password. Click the red Add Media button in the upper right hand corner, and then click Download Media Site Desktop Recorder in the center of the screen. Click the Register button under step number three. A window will pop up. Click the Open MDR button. Close all the little side tabs that open up and the main screen. And now you can navigate over to the record button in MediaSite Desktop Recorder. Here you have two choices, screencast and video or screencast and audio. Both record audio. The difference is screencast and video will record a web camera or a room camera, whereas screencast and audio will not. Name your lecture or presentation accordingly. and click the next button to proceed forward. Here you can see a preview of the classroom camera. Some classrooms have two cameras, but many classrooms only have one. Next you can select the size of the display. I generally just go with large for the camera size. Most classrooms only have one microphone to choose from, so we'll select that. And now we can test the audio in the room by clapping we will see the colored lines on the audio meter go up when we do. And then we can click the next button to proceed forward. Select the desktop you want to record. Most classrooms only have one to choose from. But to confirm that, you'll see a red ring around the screen that you're going to record. And then click the green check to proceed. At this point in time, we are ready to record. Click the red record button to start your recording. At this point in time, you'll be given a countdown and you should minimize the little control window that is in the bottom right hand of the screen. And now you're ready to start your lecture. MediaSite is recording anything that is on the screen. You can use PowerPoint or YouTube or surf the internet at this point in time if you like. Here I'm using PowerPoint just to record some slides that I've used before in the past. And now I'm done. So I'll exit out of my PowerPoint. I can just close it. Maximize the MDR preview tab that's in the system tray and click finish. We will now see our lecture uploading to our MediaSite account. You'll see a little progress status and then eventually a uploaded confirmation. If your lecture did not upload on its own, check the box next to the lecture and select Upload Recordings from the Manage Selected Recordings button in the lower left hand corner. If you'd like to see your final video, reopen your internet browser and navigate back to mediasite.osu.edu. Log back in. And now we can see that our video that we just recorded is currently uploading to our account. You might have to wait a minute or two, but click the refresh button in your internet browser. And then you should see your final video in place. We can now click on the video to play it back. Click the watch button that resides in the right hand column. Now we see our video. Click the play button in the center. We see that everything looks great and is identical to the lecture I just gave. And as you can tell, I will not appear in the window on the right because I never stepped in front of the camera. When we are done looking at the video, we can close the browser tab. Click on the three dots in the upper left hand corner and sign out. And close the browser window. We are now back in the MediaSite desktop recorder. If you want to delete the video from the desktop computer, 
make sure the video is checked, go down to manage selected recordings and remove recordings. Click the remove button. This will delete the current presentation off the desktop computer. To log out of MediaSite Desktop Recorder, go up to your name in the upper left hand corner, click forget a connection, and then click on the X next to your name. Click the forget button, and you've officially logged out of MediaSite Desktop Recorder. You can close this, and congratulations, you've completed a MediaSite Desktop Recording.